so you know when you're getting better at bodybuilding when the questions go from how much do you bench to how long does it take to get like that. So, Brian Chino, Iron City, two weeks out today for the finals, so a little under two weeks. In the pre-judging of MPC Nationals and uh, training arms. Who doesn't like training arms? So, arms have been something that I've been trying to bring up, uh, especially since junior nationals, and I think I've done a pretty good job at it. I uh, two arm workouts are not the same. I really go very instinctual with it sometimes. If I have exercise that feels great. I might do five or six sets of that and like only a couple exercises. Or I might do like one or two exercises of 10 different things. It all depends on feeling, how that exercise is feeling. And I also train them twice a week. So I have an arm day and then I train um, triceps with back and then biceps with chest. So, which I like better than doing triceps with chest and biceps with back just because the antagonist it makes my elbows feel better. It doesn't hurt as much. So. two weeks for my first attempt to try to get my pro card. It's been something I've been working at for 10, 12 years. So it's very important to me. It's, uh, I know it's the first time trying for it, but it's not, it's, it's 10 or 12 years of work. You know, it's not missing any meals, not missing any training sessions, just dedicated. So, you know, a lot of people say, I mean, the guy behind the camera asked me if I thought it was watered down and I don't think in bodybuilding it's watered down at all because it takes 10 or 12 years to put on enough tissue to be competitive to get a pro card in bodybuilding. I'm excited to say the least. I'm really excited and I really want to see how I stand and I think I got a pretty good shot. So I know I'm going to get it, you know, maybe not this time, but I, I, it's gonna happen, so I'm excited. Feels better when I sit to the side and I open my whole chest up and it just gets just my bicep that way. Just feels a little bit better. It's not fair. I stole this from Jason Huff. I really try to just take everything except for the bicep and the tricep out of the movement when I'm doing it. So this really does a good job because your arms are hanging. You can't really lift your shoulder or anything like that. And it uh, feels really good. It doesn't put too much stress in the tendon or anything like that. Just feeling the muscle belly and the peak of the contraction. So they're awesome. Try them out. Also, the bar is cool, but you know, it depends on your structure. If you're wider, your wrists don't turn the right way, dumbbells are better. So. With these, I did um, just regular spider curls and then I turned them to do hammers. Get like another you know, like 10 or so reps because it's a little bit easier. If you don't swing them, make sure you get the stretch all the way down um, because it doesn't really matter what the way you're using. They're just Christmas tree ornaments. They just need to look pretty. So make sure you get the full stretch, full contraction. Don't swing the weight. And like I said, you can do some hammers after you do 
the supinated grip just to get like a couple extra reps in, a little bit more blood. Everybody's body grows different and each one of your body parts grow differently than the other body parts. So you have to find what works best for you and that body part. So for me, my back was always a better body part. It always grew first. I always got really good contractions and pumps right from the beginning when I was in high school. You know, I used to swim and my back was definitely there. Um, so, you know, lifting heavy, I don't know, it just, it always came easier for me. Uh, for legs, when I lifted super heavy, I got really strong, but they didn't actually like look volume bigger. And when I started doing a lot more selective stuff, you'll see tomorrow, we're gonna train legs tomorrow. When I do a lot more selective stuff, but still heavy, that's when they grew. For arms, it's really just about getting the full stretch, the full contraction, not going heavy, not involving any other muscles, short rest periods, just get the blood in it.